hotel was built as a Quaker retreat. Pocono Manor is actually its own town and one of only a few remaining resorts in the United States born at the turn of the 20th century. The Quakers sold off parcels of their land to their trustees and the town of Pocono Manor was created. There's still a working post office inside the hotel. The resort has 25,000 square feet of meeting space, 238 guest rooms, and a long history of satisfied customers. There's some groups that have been coming with us for 30 years, and, and, that's, a, and that, that's a good statement in my eyes. That means we're doing, we're doing something right. During a recent renovation at the inn, management took great care not to betray the hotel's rich heritage. The new decor and ambience has been meticulously nurtured and preserved. One feature that needed no restoration was the view of the Pocono Mountains, the same serene view that attracted the Quakers back in 1901 and the same that you will enjoy when you dine at the inn's Mountain View dining room. The Inn at Pocono Manor hosts about 45 weddings a year, along with dozens of church and corporate groups, along with families who treat the Inn like home. What's really unique is when you see the families come in, and a lot of times they'll find a niche in the lobby, and that's their spot, and you'll see them there all weekend long. Then you have other guests that'll come and be out on excursions all day long, skiing or what have you, and you, you hardly see them. Winter excursions are part of the attraction of Pocono Manor, and you don't have to leave the property nor do you have to venture very far to enjoy a mode of transportation and recreation that is slightly lower tech, a place where modern machinery gives way to canine endurance. When you want to come in from the cold, there's an indoor pool, an incredible spa and health club. You can do whatever you'd like. There's indoor tennis courts, even tanning booths. Or you can simply enjoy the luxury of your newly renovated room. Each is a mixture of old world charm and modern convenience. The entire 3,000 acre property is Wi-Fi equipped just in case you want to stay connected to the outside world. If not, you are in the right place. To describe this as a hotel is, is an understatement. This is a one-stop resort where you can spend four to five days here and never leave the property. Bob says that what makes the inn work is the dedicated staff whose mission is to make sure no question goes unanswered, no need unmet. And he relies on people like Lisa Green, who loves her job. Every day is different. Every day is different. Every group is different. Every guest is different. And uh, it's always a challenge to figure out what those nuances are and try to keep everybody, you know, provide the services that they all expect. It is very clear, at least judging by the reaction of her guests, that Lisa Green and her co-workers have figured out the subtleties and nuance of service. And in doing so, they are doing their part to preserve a legacy. The Inn at Pocono Manor is more than a building. It's more than acreage and activity. It's even more than its own town. This place that sits high on a mountain is a piece of history, yours and mine. And as long as it thrives, it will remind us of another time, maybe even a time in our own lives when living was at least a little less complicated and when a room with a view was sometimes more than enough.